This year, the Headwaters Forest Reserve is celebrating its 20th anniversary as public land. Headwaters is home to 3,000 acres of old growth redwood forests and important threatened and endangered species. The remaining 4,500 acres consists of previously logged forests with extensive road networks on highly erodible soils. While Headwaters was acquired to protect the old growth forest, nearly 20 years of forest and watershed restoration are speeding the rate of recovery in second growth forests surrounding the old growth and reducing accelerated erosion rates. The Headwaters Forest Reserve is known as Headwaters because much of the old growth forest occupies the source areas of the Elk River and Salmon Creek watersheds, which both flow into Humboldt Bay. Headwaters has benefited from nearly two decades of watershed and forest restoration. As of 2019, 36 miles of roads have been decommissioned or converted into trails for access and recreation. Most of the foot traffic in Headwaters originates at Elk River Trailhead at the end of Elk River Road, just six miles from Eureka, California. And it is a very popular trail. Visitor surveys have indicated that over 40,000 people visit the reserve each year. School groups, tourists, and local residents all enjoy access to over a dozen miles of trails. When the salmon are spawning, students and hikers visit the streams to get a closer look. Luckily, the salmon are often spawning near existing vista points. The salmon attract humans but research along the South Fork Elk River has revealed some other critters interested in salmon too. Check out this bobcat hauling off a big salmon carcass. During the summer months, visitors also enjoy the south side of Headwaters. The Salmon Pass Trailhead is located on the south edge of the reserve where the headwaters of Salmon Creek and Elk River meet. Guided hikes and field trips into the old growth groves and cultural activities take place at the Salmon Pass Trailhead, not far from Fortuna. A community of volunteer docents with Friends of Headwaters lead hikes from May to November. These hikes are organized through the Fortuna Chamber of Commerce. Treating the many miles of roads and skid trails, stream crossings and log landings has been a monumental undertaking. The goal of treating roads and landslides is to reduce hill slope erosion rates preventing sediment from impacting downstream salmon habitats. Roughly 60% of headwaters was logged prior to acquisition. These stands are now in need of some attention, given the goals of the reserve managers to grow old forests in healthy watersheds. The cutover land became very dense stands of young forests, and most of the regeneration was Douglas fir rather than redwood. In order to promote old growth characteristics, 1,800 acres of logged over lands have been identified for forest restoration activities such as forest thinning and fuels reduction. The goal of forest restoration is to accelerate the recovery of old growth forest conditions, a vision that will take centuries to achieve. The Headwaters Forest Reserve is a unique ecological reserve. Due to its unique forest composition and remote setting, Headwaters provides critical habitat to many interesting wildlife species, big and small, avian and aquatic. Fish and wildlife research conducted over the past 20 years has helped us to appreciate the importance of having an area that is truly remote. At the turn of the century, the town of Falk was a bustling lumber camp, producing the logs that built Eureka and rebuilt San Francisco after the 1906 earthquake. Today, Falk is a recovering forest, and the old train barn now serves as the Headwaters Education Center. In the 1980s, following the takeover of the Pacific Lumber Company by the Maxam Corporation, the rate of cutting on Maxam lands increased dramatically. The Headwaters Grove was discovered in the mid-1980s by forest activists who recognized that the last stand of ancient redwoods in the Humboldt Bay region was rapidly disappearing. Tree sits, protests, and rallies brought attention to the need for forest protection. 
with the help of some big name politicians, musicians, and a huge number of dedicated activists and local residents. After 10 years of struggle, a controversial but acceptable agreement was created which was signed just in the nick of time. In March of 1999, the state and federal acquisition was finalized, creating a nearly 7,500-acre forest reserve. Approximately 40% of the reserve is unharvested ancient redwood forest, a truly unique ecosystem. And the rest is now in the process of recovery, thanks to intensive restoration efforts and the collaborative efforts of state and federal agencies, restoration practitioners, and a long list of cooperators. The primary benefactors of the Headwaters Forest Reserve are all the species that live and visit there. That's why we call it a reserve. Experience Headwaters. You will be glad that you did.